We are recording so I'm afraid I have to ask you to leave. If you would follow me, Miku. Don't ignore us. Hi Ruta, your math teacher called. She said you're failing math. Why do you always fail your math lessons? Well, it's just that, I don't know. Excuse me sir. What's wrong? I give up. I'll just go see if Oliver is busy recording. Come with me, Tarot. Yes, master. Why did you leave when that person called you? Miku can tell you that. What happened? I'm kind of failing math. I'm good at math. I can help you if you want. What do you need help with? My teacher is trying to teach us about imaginary numbers. But when I try to say one, she says I'm wrong. What do you say? Double. Really? What? That's not an imaginary number. But I made it up though. You're in algebra to write. Yes. Yet you can tell the difference between imaginary numbers and make-believe numbers. What is the difference? I must come down. An imaginary number is the square root of a negative number, like the square root of negative 4. But wouldn't that be two? No, it wouldn't. Yes, it would. Look. Why does it say error? Because it's an imaginary number. You see, when you enter a negative number in a square root, you'll never get an answer. But to get the answer, you have to use the sign I. Why I? Oh, it's for imaginary. I'm lost. Um, let's try this again. What's the square root of negative 4? I just told you it said the law. Alright, so this is what you do. Find what makes the square root of negative 4. Remember that one of the numbers must be a perfect square. Um, that would be 4 and negative 1, right? The square root of 4. That would be 2. But what about negative 1? This is where the sign I comes in. You see, I stand for the square root of negative 1. So knowing this, what's the square root of negative 4? Um, do I? You got it. Really? So now what's the square root of negative 9? Uh, 9 times negative 1 makes negative 9, and the square root of 9 is 3, so then that would be 3, I, right? That's right. I'm so proud of you. Thank you. No problem. I never thought you would be so good at math. That's mean. You guys done here? Yeah, the yeah, done. Great, now leave. Can we please sing a song with her? Please. Fine, what track? Track 7. Dancing bear, painted wings Things I almost remember And there's so someone sings Once upon a December